we are here today to celebrate the love that Andrew and Paige share with each other. We are also here to give social recognition to their desire to commit their lives to each other and to accept each other with all of their hearts. Paige and Andrew both have this incredible devotion for family and for friends. Both of you are such good people, deserving of each other's love and an inspiration to all of us. I have an incredible sister, and I've been doubly blessed this evening by gaining an incredible brother, too. To this day, uh, Paige has fit in unbelievably to the family. It's a fantastic addition, and I love to see Andrew and you both so happy. I've always and still do look up to you every single day. Growing up with you as my sister was a blessing. You are loyal and giving, and so, so thoughtful, and you make the extra effort to be there for me and our, our entire family every day. I'm holding on to something better than anything I've ever known. We live in seasons like the weather, but one thing's constant all along. Many of you here today have witnessed what started as a mutual attraction that began in that coffee shop outside of Endicott College blossom into the beautiful romance that has brought all of us here today so that Andrew and Paige may take each other's hand in marriage. When I'm feeling lost or running low, I sink into your love just like a I remember the first day I met Paige. She walked out of the car, came into the house, and I said, what the hell is in the water in Maine? Beautiful, great smile, great personality. She sat right down on the couch, had great conversations. We went to brunch. She told me stories that <laughs> we died laughing the entire time, and it felt like I knew her. All of us have loved in our lifetimes. And in this moment, Andrew and Paige serve as a reminder to us all that love is the very best part of being alive. Do you, Andrew, take Paige to be your lawfully wedded wife, to share your life with her, standing with her in sickness and in health, in joy and in sorrow, in hardship and in ease, to cherish and love as long as you both shall live. I do. Andrew, I love the way you make her laugh and the little stories she tells us about all the kind things you do for people that you don't even know. You and your family are such a perfect addition to our family, and I am so grateful you are all in our lives. You are loyal and steadfast and funny as hell. I so look forward to watching you and my sister grow together. Do you, Paige, take Andrew <laughs> to be your lawfully wedded husband, to share your life with him, standing with him in sickness and in health, in joy and in sorrow, in hardship and in ease, to cherish and love as long as you both shall live? I do. Andrew and Paige, by the power vested in me by the state of Maine, I now pronounce you husband and wife. Andrew, you may get the right.
being around them as friends and family, I mean, you can't buy that kind of happiness. I can't be happier as, as uh, Paige's dad to bring Andrew and that kind of laughter, love, and sense of family in. And to be honest, um, I can't wait to see where the future takes us and where their love of family and devotion and where their sense of laughter and humor help them to build the future. It's the perfect kind